Greetings, dear friends, in Christ's strong name. Welcome to another point of view, where we get to reflect together on the insight of one of the insights re related to the Sermon of the Week. This week, the third Sunday after Epiphany, we looked at Luke chapter 4, verses 14 through 21. And the theme of that sermon was the Spirit of the Lord is upon me. We saw that the Spirit himself anointed Jesus as the Messiah, as the Chosen One, to proclaim God's salvation for the poor and the needy. And in today's meditation, we saw that Jesus came in the fulfillment of Messianic prophecy to proclaim the year of the Lord's favor. Dear friends, the hope one day that God will come and establish a new order in the earth is precisely the mission of the Messiah. This is what is written in Luke 4, 17 through 19. The Spirit of the Lord is upon me because he's anointed me to proclaim good news to the poor, to proclaim liberty to the captives, recovering of sight to the blind, to set at liberty those who are oppressed, to proclaim the year of the Lord's favor. That very same thing is in this Isaiah text that Jesus said. It's very important that we see that in verse 2, Jesus stopped mid-sentence. Jesus ended his reading with, to proclaim the year of the Lord's favor. But the end of the verse says, and the day of vengeance of our God. Jesus didn't, read, didn't say that. He didn't read that. Because in his first coming, he did not come to, to bring wrath and vengeance upon the earth. He came to save it. The spirit of the Lord is upon Christ in the first coming to redeem the world and to bring it back to God.